next year, I will be going to Shoreline Community College, way up in North Seattle, to do music stuff. Uh, next year, I'll be going to the Seattle Diving Institute to become an underwater welder. Next year, I'll be going to Washington State University, studying pre-law and business management. Next year, I will be attending University of Washington, Seattle to study aerospace engineering. Next year, I will be attending Seattle University, and I don't know what my major will be yet. It's a surprise, I guess. Next year, I will be hopefully on my mission, but when I come back, I'll be attending Penn State University with a full ride scholarship for rugby. Next year, I'm going to go to Highline for two years, then I'm going to transfer into another college if I like. Otherwise, I'm just going to go into business with my dad and make a lot of free money, pretty much. Next year, I'm going to go to Massachusetts for college at Williams College. Um, it's in the middle of nowhere in some mountains. Next year, I will be working towards becoming an orthodontist. <laughs> Next year, I will be attending the University of Oregon Lundquist College of Business in Eugene. Next year, I will be out of here. Next year, I will go to Hanlon and I'm going to transfer to UW. Next year, I will be attending Washington State University studying sports medicine. Um, my favorite memory is at KM has to be all my uh, four seasons of track here. My favorite memory of in KM is pretty much in uh, IB bio class. We did, it was really fun with Gabriel. He just did really awkward and weird stuff. My favorite memory of KM is probably having to meet my new friends, or friends that I've made, because without my friends, um, I don't think I'd really be determined to go to school or try as much. Uh, my favorite memory of KM has to be all the sports that I've played over my four years here, baseball and football. They've all been great memories that I'll remember for the rest of my life. My favorite memory of KM is coming together after football and it was just fun hanging out with all my buddies. My favorite memory of KM is last year, my junior year, uh, when everybody jumped in the back of my truck and threw water balloons. My favorite memory of KM, I, I don't know if I have one, I just loved every second of it. I came here, everyone's super friendly all the time, the teachers cared, it's easy. My favorite memory of KM is messing around with my teachers, you know, laughing and getting a lot of help from them. My favorite part about KM is definitely the people because I think we have a large um, variety of different opinions and different likes and that all kind of combines into one giant, you know, we call it like the royal family, which is kind of cheesy. but. It's also true that we combine into this whole um, family unit. My favorite memory of KM is getting here, my first date. I was a sophomore when I first got here. It was really weird because I did not know absolutely anyone. But I started making friends and I guess my favorite part was just meeting a whole bunch of different cultures and meeting a whole bunch of different people, different backgrounds. The best part of KM is the staff at KM because they're just so encouraging and they want to see you succeed. My favorite memory of KM is uh, when I first started, um, I think, sophomore year and then I joined a club and um, it was really fun because club is when you get uh, together with the teacher, the students, some of the students too. My favorite memory of KM would be making it to state, the state tournament for wrestling and wrestling with my brothers and family members. My favorite memory of KM is sophomore year, fourth period, Mr. Gabriel's class with Stephanie O'Hare and Josh Smith. And the best part of KM, I'll have to say, is the athletics because everybody that's part of it knows how much um, adversity we face and somehow we always come out on top. Uh, the best part about Cam is pretty much we're all like a family and it's really nice to have each other and we can joke around pretty easily and get to know one another and we're pretty much like a family. The best part of Cam has to be the people that you just encounter yourself with, the friends and teachers and everyone that you, you bond with over the four years that you're here is just magnificent. The best part of KM is the attention that you receive from teachers. Um, I personally receive a lot of individual attention from all of my educators and that helped me succeed at school. 
the best part of CAM is the teachers. They, they really help you and really put you through the struggle to, to become what you want to be. Best part of CAM is definitely the community. The teachers, the teachers that really care, you can tell they care. They're fun to be around with people that are easy to go along with. It's just, it's just very easy. The best part about KM is sitting in a classroom full of diverse group of students and getting to know students with different backgrounds and where they come from and truly understanding who that person is. So the best part about KM is the whole community, um, how the teachers and the students all work together and the diversity. The best part of KM is that it's very diverse and also everyone's really welcoming, friendly, and kind. The teacher I want to thank most is um, Mr. Roma and Ms. Lynn and Ms. Bolzen because they all pushed me to my full potential. Um, I want to thank all my teachers because without them, they've all, they've all helped me during class, so without them I don't think I would have passed my classes. Uh, if I had to pick one teacher to thank, it'd be Miss Clark. Even though she's not here anymore, she really drove me to become a better student in Excel. And I just thank, thank her for all of her hard work. The teacher I want to thank most is Mrs. Beth Shoemaker. Uh, she's been a really great inspiration to me, and she's part of the reason of why I want to become a teacher when I grow up. The teacher I want to thank the most is Miss Hopkins, because she helped me overcome many struggles, and she helped me be more motivational to help others. The teacher I want to thank is Mr. Green for uh, helping me out. For the, I've been in this class for all four years, and he's really taught me a variety of stuff and the goals that I want to become. The teacher I want to thank most is Philip Emerson because his, his explanations of the things of history is just the way he taught history changed my life entirely. Made me think of everything differently. Um, the teacher I would like to thank the most is Mrs. Chandler because you were my mentor when I went to the Washington Youth Academy and not only that, when I came back, you also helped me. And the one thing that I want to thank you for the most is being close to my family and that means the world to me. The teacher I'd like to thank most is Deborah Drake. Um, because in all of my academic experience, um, she's been the one that's most made me feel um, kiddish, I guess, and gave me permission to be immature and like a regular high school person. So the teacher I want to thank the most would probably miss, be Mrs. Hopkins, my weightlifting teacher. And I want to thank her the most just because she had pushed me mentally and physically to be at my best and to really push myself because without her, I didn't really realize what I was capable of and didn't realize how, how when you exercise and when you push yourself, it's always mental. It's always about pushing yourself every day to become better. The teacher I want to thank most is Miss Baines because she is such an inspirational woman figure and she stands up for what she believes in. Uh, the teacher I want, I want to thank the most is um, Mr. Seal, he's an ELM teacher. I want to thank him because when I first came, um, my English wasn't that good enough, but like he helped us a lot. And um, whenever I need help, I am just ask him and he just helped me. Teacher I want to thank the most is Mrs. Kim McClung because she um, was a great mentor to me when I was younger and she always kept a smile on my face. And when I did the same for her, she would always let me know. And I'm very thankful of her teaching and guidance. The teachers I want to thank the most is Miss Lynn, Miss Hopkins, and Mr. Tracy. Miss Lynn for being there no matter what and talking to her about anything and helping me along the lines when I thought I wasn't going to get there with my problems. Miss Hopkins for showing me that I have leadership skills and just being comfortable with who I am. Mr. Transier for teaching video production and business law, and now I know what I want to do with my future. Dear Mom, Dad, thank you for supporting me through life-changing events. Um, Dad especially, thank you for wholeheartedly loving our family. And to the rest of my big family, thank you for giving me the strength to overcome anything. Mom and my brother, thank you guys for supporting me. And I hope my moving away doesn't like, separate us and bring us even closer. Mom, Dad, uh, it's been a tough 17 years, but 
I thank you for all that you've done for me. Both of you have contributed a lot to who I am today, and I'm thankful for that. Hey, Dad, it's, uh, it's me, Dion, here now, and I'm going to be leaving home soon. Uh, I'm as sad as you are, but you know it's for the best. Mom, 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 thank you so much for being you. Beautiful, smart, rich, you're great. Mother, father, I'm graduating. You are well aware. I know you're well aware. I know you're proud of me. You don't have to say it. I know you love me. You don't have to say it. Thank you, Mom and Dad, for always supporting me and always being there for me um, and for always telling me to do the best I could. And because of them, I'm now going to graduate this, um, this year. So I'm very happy. Mom, Dad, thank you for pushing me. Thank you for being my one number one fan. Thank you for um, not giving up on me when I had my trials and tribulations and I would like to say that I promise you everything I do in life it's for you guys even if I don't succeed I'll always try. Dear family, thanks for supporting me and thanks for standing beside me. I know that this road hasn't been very easy but I do appreciate that you guys haven't given up on me and that you guys have supported me through everything I've decided to do. Mom, I want to thank you for being great, pushing me through my high school career. Hi mom, hi dad. Mom, I hope you're not crying right now because I'll be really embarrassed if you are. Um, but I understand you have like, I don't know, this parental obligation to like, I don't know, feel affection right now. So I guess I'd understand, but I'd still be embarrassed. Dear Mom, Dad, if you guys are watching this, I just want to thank you guys for your support. Um, you guys have been my motivation. You guys have told me to always keep on looking forward. Dear Mom, I'm really thank you because you always be there for me and whenever I do something, you just tell me like don't give up and just keep on doing it and then you give a lot of, you give me a lot of courage. Mom, you don't have to worry about a thing when I go to college because I'm gonna come back a millionaire. Dad, thanks for just being you and always pushing me to do better and to achieve nothing less than greatness. Chandra, thanks for being there and being the mom thing. The thing I will miss the most about KM has to be coming to school with my brother every day. The thing I'll miss most about KM is I can really be comfortable around people and just do whatever I feel like. I can be weird and yeah, pretty much. The one thing I'll miss the most at KM is uh, just the bond that you create with all your friends and teachers and coaches and everything. The thing I will miss most about Cam is how everybody just seems to look out for one another and there hasn't been really much conflict this year. Things I will miss in most of Cam is probably the funny memories I make with my friends. Things I'll miss about Cam is all my friends, growing up with them through kindergarten all the way to 12th grade. The thing I will miss about Cam the most is my friends and some of the other classmen. The thing I will miss most about KM is probably the staff. I would honestly miss Mr. Transier's class every day. <laughs> that was a fun class. The thing that I will miss uh, the most about KM is um, all the teachers because I will miss them. My high school experience, one word, would be crazy. Grand. Weird. It's memorable. Life changing. Strange. Insane. Awesome. Special. Interesting. Intense. Wonderful. Awakening. Wow. Wacky. For sure. Well,